What's up, y'all? It's the big dog, NET. I decided to finally finish painting this room, so I figured I might as well show you guys a few tricks that I use when I'm painting. First thing I want to let you guys know about is the lint roller. If you don't own one of those paint rollers at the moment, you can use this lint roller. It's very simple. You can just dip this into the bucket of paint or use the paint that you already have prepared in the tray and just lather it against the wall like so. Next thing I want to let you guys know about is uh, how to tackle these corners, these edges. You just scoop a nice amount of paint into your hand and grab a little bit and hit them corners. Very simple. And Hold on one second, guys. Hey, babe, what's up? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Calm down. No, I did not hang up on you. No. I didn't. I don't know, something happened. Yeah, that's because that always seemed to be the case. Yeah, something. Why would I have hung up on you? No, like you, that's what I'm saying. You be tripping. You be tripping. No. I'm trying to finish this. Trying to finish this this uh room on paint. Hold on. Going on instructions. Yeah. Yeah. Get around to finish paint. Yeah. Yeah. Relax. 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 It ain't that serious. No, I won't hang up on you no more. Whatever. That's your thing, I did. All right. Hold on one second. All right, y'all, another thing, if uh, you're a beginner and you don't notice, you have to stir the paint before you use the paint. So get a, get something that you, you know, I guess you get a stick of wood outside or, but I'm using this. Oh my, oh my God. Oh, shit. hello. Hello. Oh, shit. Oh my God. Oh, oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my god. Oh my shit. Hello. Hello. All right, y'all, so I'm back. What was that? Uh, yeah, the next thing I want to let you guys know about is how to patch up a hole on a wall. If you uh, want to know how to cover up a hole, you just take some notebook paper, fold it neatly, tape it to the wall right over the hole, and you uh, paint right over that, and that should look just fine. Next thing I want to let you guys know about is uh, if you don't have one of those big paint rollers, you can use one of these. I think this is called a wall roller. I bought it near, it was near the kitchen supplies, so I think it's used for like kitchen walls. But you just, you can either dip this into the paint bucket, use the paint prepared in a tray, or, uh, and yeah, and that's it. Roll it across the wall and that shit be good. And hold on one second. I knew she would call my other phone. Yeah. Yeah, hello. No, I did not hang up on you, no. No. The call dropped. Literally into the bucket of paint. <laughs> no, I, no, I, I know it wasn't funny. I'm sorry. All right, yeah, I'm finishing up now. Yes, I'm, I'm very close to being finished. Hold on. All right, y'all. So that pretty much wraps this up. So, but yeah, hopefully you learned a lot. You know what I'm saying? Hopefully this will help you next time you're painting. Until next time. Oh my God, you've got to be kidding me. <laughs> He's a wild boy.